So this is what our thing looks like. Hopefully I don't drop this in the oven. Okay, so I whipped all the eggs. Like I said, this is my second video. Yeah. I'm putting... Wait, what? Cheese. In the, in the eggs? Yep. Okay, then you put cheese in the eggs. Oh. Huh? Okay. Okay, so this is what it looks like in the oven. Like I said, I hope I don't drop this in the oven. You just make sure it's all crispy and stuff. See how it's all moving? That's it getting really crispy. Okay, so, um... Looks good. Um, so next, um, we'll get some cheese. Doesn't matter what type of cheese we're using mix, like I said on the first video. Mm. We're something up. Yeah, I, I saw, I told them that. So then you put some cheese in the egg mix. Mama, can you do it extra wet just to make sure? Yeah. So, just make sure you do an extra whip, just to make sure it's all the yellow dot, big dot thingies, whatever they're called, or like... Make sure everything's mixed together, the whites and make, the yolks. Just make everything's mixed together, so it doesn't matter how much cheese you put in, just don't, don't put, put in... Too a, much. Huh? You don't want to put in too much. You don't want to put in too much, and then because then... The egg part will just taste all like cheese. And that will be disgusting. But I like cheese, but I wouldn't mind, but I don't know if you guys are allergic to cheese or anything. But, um, so you just gave me like a couple, like one handful and half. And so that would be enough. And then you stir that with your, with your whisk or fork, but we're using a fork. And also, don't forget to clean up because... This kind of makes a lot. Oh, when you cut the bacon, make sure you use one of these things. You don't want to get your counter all dirty. Cutting board. Cutting board. Okay, so this is what the things look like when they're out of the oven. This is what they're supposed to look like. It doesn't have to look like this. It has to look like a little something like this. Can they see it? Can they, mm, see they can see it. Yeah, they can see it. Okay. Might have to straighten some of them out. Yeah, some of them will curl. Some of them will like be like that when you put them in the curl in. So sometimes you might just need to straighten them out. You might get a little burnt, but um. I'm gonna put it back in there, and make them a little more crispy. Yeah. So if you're not, if they don't, or if they're not crispy enough, just put them back in there for a couple more minutes, like five minutes or per se. Um. And I've added my baking channel on YouTube. This is my both of my channels. I do daring videos, um, regular videos. I just talk to you guys. And now, today, I just added cooking. I just added cooking. Teach you guys how to cook some cool recipes. Some of these, a thing later today, I learned from Cupquake. Um, she's really cool. She does awesome Minecraft videos. I hope you watch her. She makes she. She does like Slender, Minecraft, and um, baking. So we're doing, doing one of her baking things. I'm sorry guys, I, I don't do gaming on here because I don't know how to figure it out. How to. If you guys can leave a comment below and find out how to do that, please get me. Please get me and um, send me an email or something. Um, also, today what we're going to make like later in the day, I don't know when... Uh, we're just going to make it today. We're going to make slime ice cream popsicles. They're from Minecraft, the slimes thingies that are like little squares. Yeah. Okay, guys. Um, okay, so I'm just going to talk to you because I'm just waiting for everything to be done. Thanks. I'm going to go put the cheese. Mommy, do we need the cheese anymore? Uh, I'm just going to put it back in the refrigerator. So you put the cheese back in the refrigerator. You can also put some cheese on top when I tell you that. Um, yeah, my mom loved baking things. I should when I started YouTube. I should have thought about baking, but I did it later. Yeah. Okay. So, like I said, just make sure everything's extra whip. 
Make sure some cheese, you still got some cheese in there. Yeah, yeah, just don't add a lot of cheese because it will be disgusting. You want to make sure you have the bacon flavor and the egg flavor and the cheese flavor. Just don't add a lot of cheese. Um, just, 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 just let you know that. Mom, I'm going to check on the thing. Okay. This is what the big, nah, I'm not, nah, I'm not going to show you guys. Don't see it. Um, it's, I don't know if it looks good enough, but it looks good to me. It looks nice and crispy. Warm air just blew into my Be right back, guys. You just. Mom. I'm right here. See, that didn't take long. <laughs> so, I don't know how much this is going to be cut into up in any videos. But this is going to be a couple of videos to teach you how to make this. But it doesn't take long. Just, um, hear that crispy sound. That's, Excuse me. That's the bacon. So, get the ladle. Me and my mom love to cook, don't we? Yes. Yay. Oh, I know. You're in my way. Whoops, I can't move. I'm looking for the ladle. I don't know where. So this is what they're supposed to look like when they're done out in the oven. They have to look exactly like that. So then you get like a ladle or like a spoon dipper thingy like how my mom has in her hand. Make sure you have a sharp knife when you cut it. Cut the bacon. To cut the bacon. So then you get like a sprout thingy, and then then you put the um, egg mix thingy that we just whipped a couple minutes ago in the bacon. Or on top of the bacon. Or on top of the bacon. Let me do this one. So we're going to take turns on each and every row, Oops. and we'll show you what it looks like Go ahead. when it's done. So we're each going to do two. You don't have to have a lot. No, don't. you don't need a lot. You don't need a lot. Because you don't want it all to taste like that. Or you don't want it to overflow like mine did. <laughs> Excuse me, Otis. Otis is her dog. I've showed you some videos of him. Doggy and doggy, too. Yeah, like, you don't... It just depends how if you like eggs a lot or not. We are adding, like, almost to the top, just not... Let's show them. We're adding almost to the top. Okay, so this is the thing you need to use to get that thingy or something close to it. Oh, so that's what it looks like. Can they see it? Yeah, they can see it. Okay, um, that's what it looks like. See, you can see some cheese. We didn't add a lot of cheese because, like I said, it's going to get disgusting. Disgusting. <laughs> you want to put a little bit on top? Oh, yeah, you, yeah, we should, yeah. So we're going to put half on top, half cheese on. A little bit uh, of cheese on top. Yeah, so we're going to put this all cheese and that one no cheese. So we're going to put half side and cheese and half side no cheese. So we're going to add some cheese to it on top. Ugh. I'm going to go back and get the cheese. Stay right there, guys. No. Okay. Oh, I hope I get a lot of comments because I like looking through my emails what they commented. They're starting to cook already. Okay, so the the eggs the, they just cook it in there like because the bacon's hot and stuff. And they cook by themselves. So you just add a little bit of cheese on each one. Don't add a lot. Like a little half a pan for a little pinch. So you're gonna do only this side and no that side. Okay. You can always this is like a quick snack for breakfast. If you're really hungry and you're home alone. Well, I wouldn't do it home alone. If you're a Make adult. Make sure a parent and adult if you're, is if with you're you. you're an adult. So don't add a lot of cheese. This is what it looks like. You need to add some cheese. There, can they see it? Yeah, they can see it. Okay, so now what it looks like without cheese. So the, so the eggs, like I said, they cook in it. And then you put the eggs back in the oven for about five minutes. Maybe. We're half, half the eggs are done. I until the eggs are done. This like, is our first time making this. This is our first Kinda time making it up as we go. Yeah, we just we just want to add more cheese. That's not how the re recipe well, says. We don't really have a recipe. 
we just, just kind of making it up. As she we just looked along. it up online and she just. Well, I saw a glimpse of something similar. And so we're just kind of making up our own little recipe. So if you guys want to pass this on to a little family member or something, so I'm going to stop this video and I'll make another video later um, in a couple of minutes. Okay, guys, don't forget to subscribe and comment. Bye. Hope you like this video too.